Sound Booth Theater presents. Look, Balder, or Oral Gel, or whatever you're calling yourself now, if you're about to do some crazy villain speech, could we find some shade before you get into it? I don't know about you, but I'm boiling my ass off in this armor. Stephen Park's kid brother. He always said you were witty, with a sharp sense of humor. I see he was wrong about that, too. I feel a tsunami heading for Vlotia. A black tide full of monsters and human hatred. And I find myself thinking back to my own unfinished business. We have to play defense until we spot the gap in Rorgale's plans. But we also have to be ready to strike. And for that, we need power, experience, weapons, resources. And we don't have much time. Balda conquered two-thirds of Ravala in a month. We might lose the whole bloody country. We aren't going to renew the call like the others. We are going to destroy the Drachen and put an end to the cycle once and for all. Then this world's end has arrived. And soon, it will be a grave for all species, all races, other than the Drachen. Don't count on it. Suri fought her whole life to survive. I was born dead and clawed my way back to life. The biggest war machine in the world of Earth wasn't able to kill Hector, no matter how hard it tried. We have something the Drachen don't. We believe life has meaning, and we're willing to fight for it. It has to end somewhere, and the buck stops here, with us. Maybe that's what I've been doing wrong all this time, Ambrose. Should have been introducing myself to the ladies as the man with the Spear of Destiny. 